Hi, this is David Frayne, the editor of Tools of the Trade magazine. I'm here today at JLC Live in Portland with Darren of Bullet Tools, who's going to show us the siding sear that their company makes. Darren? Okay, what we've got here is some fiber cement. You slide that through to so wherever your mark is, take your handle, slide it straight down, cut it, and you're done. As you can see, you get a nice clean cut on there. It's got a nice perfect edge. One of, the sec one of the other things that's really nice here is how thin you can actually cut this and you can actually just shave off just a thin little slice here. As little as a sixteenth of an inch can be shaved off of your piece. As you can see, very easy to do. So you've just got a knife in that shear. It's just kind of knife's coming down when you pull that handle. Exactly. It's a very sharp blade. It's flat on the inside and it's beveled on the back side so you always get that nice sharp clean edge. Angles. You've actually got a pitch guide here on the table that lists out many of the different pitches, 4, 6, 8, 10, and 12. This, for example, would be a 612 pitch. You slide your board right through there. So you can do that for cut and trim for a rake or something. Exactly. Either direction. Cut it, and you can see just how sharp that corner is. Perfect 612 pitch every time. Doesn't look like you get much of any dust either. No dust no power, also very quiet. This unit weighs 22 pounds, so it's also very light as well. Now the unit's just the top part, I take it the stand is extra? Correct, it's just the tool. There is also an optional stand that you can get for the, for the tool as well. Now what material have you got there, Darren? What we have here is some fiber cement trim. This particular one is five quarter hardy. You can easily just slide it right through there, again to wherever your mark is. Take your handle, cut it, and you're done. And you saw how easy that yeah, was. Yeah, wow. So, Very little effort at all. So what else would you cut on this? OSB, LP for example, OSB, trim and also siding. Slide that through and just cut it and be done. And you wow. can see how crisp, there's no chipping of the edge, there's no fibers that are being peeled up, there's no touch up that's going to be necessary. You can also use the tool on flooring. For example, laminate flooring. Works on all different types of laminate flooring. You just slide that in there, cut it, and you're done. Wow. And there's your edge. Cool. Perfect every time. It also works on engineered hardwood flooring. It works on, here's a piece of engineered hardwood right here. Slide that in there. And again, nice perfect edge. Now, what's the widest this particular unit can cut? This unit here is the SST20, also known as an Easy Shear 20 inch. Cuts 20 inches wide, uh, cuts up to one inch thick. And what's a, what does that sell for, ballpark? This unit here would normally sell for about $489.95 MSRP. Okay, and you, I assume that there are some other size um, shears of this type you guys make? There is also a 13 inch model and a 9 inch model. Cool, and, and how long uh, can I take it you can replace the blades on those if they ever get dull? Blades are replaceable as well. Uh, about $80 for a replacement blade for this unit, $50 for a 13 inch, and about $40 for a 9 inch replacement blade. Also, it comes with a sharpening stone. To sharpen the blade, you don't even have to take the blade off. You just run it along the inside of the blade about five times after you do a job, ready for another project. If you do that, when cutting fiber cement, you're going to get about 10,000 cuts before you need to replace that blade. So for the average siding contractor, you're talking about a year and a half of blade life. So that's a much longer than if you used your circular saw blades. Yeah, and just one last question, where are you guys located and where do you make these machines? We're proudly located in Hayden, Idaho, northern Idaho, uh, and we make this tool in the U.S. Great, well thank you very much, Darren. Thank you.